uh, are you ever going to consider big brother honestly i haven't had this youtube thing are you currently dating ha huh. guy i want to have so much money something i have always looked forward to and that kind of really made my may and that is really something to be grateful for to be honest hey guys what's up welcome back to my channel this voice is my morning voice and to be honest i don't like it okay <laughs> the earliest i've filmed is like past nine but i have to film this video now because i don't know when i'm going to have time to film it again yeah i'm heading out today is very much a very busy day hmm. who else likes capricorn i love capricorn a lot when i was in nigeria but now i take zesto because it's like almost same taste i've had these q a questions that came in over a month ago but i haven't had the time to film you know sit down videos yet i've just been winging it time to answer these questions i brought a question tag on my youtube community post and also my insta story if you don't follow me on instagram please do i tried to rearrange the questions so that you know the video will go in accordance do you understand how are you for the most part i'm doing very well i'm fine thank you thank you so much for asking because i feel like for the most part of this year i have been you know trying my best to stay happy stay positive you know celebrating my wins small wins big wins whatever it is i try to celebrate for the most part of me i was able to spend time with my best girls which is something i have always looked forward to ever since i moved from cebu that kind of really made my may i haven't had any mental breakdown so far i haven't been sick like i have you know felt maybe a bit of headache or that but i haven't really been to the hospital since the beginning of this year and that is really something to be grateful for to be honest i've just been so grateful for the growth on my youtube channel a lot of new subscribers and all that stuff god has been so good what's one thing you really want to change one thing i really want to change is poverty to be honest guy i want to have so much money i want to be so rich to afford the lifestyle that i think person asks how do you edit your youtube video i edit on different editing apps it just depends on what i want currently i'm in love with vn but i find it really really slow i don't know why i also like to use CapCut. i also like to use inshot i used inshot for a very long time for over one year for over two years save i was using inshot and i used to use the free version but now i use the paid version if i want to do you know some things um yeah that's it for my youtube and yes i edit on my phone in case you want to what app do you use for thumbnail i use InShot for thumbnail all the time but you see all those thumbnail where i attach um people's picture on the side i use cap cut and then i kind of screen grab and then go to InShot and finish up and then either i go to InShot and finish up or i go to canva and finish up so it just depends when are you coming back to nigeria you'll find out very soon mm -hmm. what advice can you give upcoming youtubers to stay productive consistent and attract large audience honestly i haven't hacked this youtube thing um but one thing i know is in order to stay productive try to film you know couple of videos pick out a day that you know that you don't have so much to do do your makeup and then you know you just have to switch up your wigs sometimes i don't really switch up my wigs i just switch up my shirts and then i film at least three four videos a day so three four videos can last me two weeks um you know aside the vlogs then for my vlogs i just vlog my life sometimes not everything actually sometimes i'm not in the mood to vlog i just live in the moment i see me just add maybe clips that i made for my instagram on the side before i start a vlog i already know that that week of mine there are so many things that i want to do if you have a youtube channel and you used to upload three times a week and one day in one week you now miss one day your algorithm resets somehow i don't know 
your algorithm will go down you get the engagement to go down so and as a small youtuber one thing i want to tell you is don't go away for too long it's not good you're going to be easily forgotten so while you're trying to grow if you're under 1k subscribers or like maybe you're on 1k you've not got it to like 10k i don't know why you're slowing down just try your best fill out content just just put out something every week that's what i would say so that people don't forget you when it comes to attracting large audience i don't have large audience to be honest i have a thousand subscribers and i still have 100 and something views 200 views which is very poor for someone with a thousand four hundred subscribers i'm supposed to be getting at least 500 600 700 views but i don't get up to that and that is really sad only a few of my videos seem to blow up and they don't even blow up that much i think my my most popular video is about four thousand something views so that way you can see that my journey is quite slow i i mean for someone that's been on youtube for four years it's quite slow but one thing i know is i'm trying to do this organically i've never bought views likes comments i've never bought any engagement on my channel i just believe that when it's god's time is definitely going to do well for me how has moving to manila been for you so far i feel like i've grown i have understood life a lot more better um i have met people that have been able to you know impact my life in a good way so i've made some really good acquaintances people that i talk to once in a while and you know i kind of pick out one or two from them so i feel like with my circle, I've been able to screen through. I'm not so accessible to everyone. Um, I've also come to realize that in this life, everything is transactional, one way or the other. So if I'm associating with you, I know that I'm gaining something from you. Not necessarily money, but wisdom, knowledge, you know, exposure from you. This moving just came with some sort of growth and you know also the inside work that i decided to do for myself you guys know last year i was really working on leveling up. have you ever been attracted to females or has a female been attracted to you in brackets intimate this question when i saw it i was like i don't understand but no i haven't i have never been intimate with a girl before have I ever been attracted to a girl? Of course, yes. There are some times when you see a girl and you're like, this girl is hot. But nothing aside from that. You team, show us your mister before marriage or team. I will keep him private to after marriage. I feel like showing off your partner, there's nothing wrong in it. But keeping your relationship private is, is where people struggle. I mean, when you put out everything about your relationship online, absolutely doesn't make sense but if you show like when you guys are hanging out you guys are having good time go on vacations that's there's nothing wrong in that if you will break up you break up okay for me i don't mind showing my partner to close friends yes but to people that just randomly follow me no i'm not going to show off my man or anything like that until there's a ring on the hand what's one thing you fear the most in life one thing i fear the most in life is death and not having freedom when i mean not free not having freedom i mean like sickness not being able to move around i'll just die are you currently dating are you ever going to consider big brother <laughs> i've been getting this whole big brother thing for like three years now i don't know yet if i will but never say never it can happen maybe what is your editing process like my editing process is like import the clips that i've taken rough cut i go ahead to add my youtube intro and outro i pick out the clips if it's vlogs or even sit down videos i pick out the clips that i want to be in the beginning before the intro just to catch people's attention yeah i pick it out and put it before the intro then i now start adding effects after i'm done adding effects and transitions where i want them to be i add um 
the days so if it's my vlogs i begin to add monday wednesday this is what i did this is what i did like that or like write-ups if there are any place i need to write write-ups like their locate the location i'm at and all that the next thing i do is i work on my sounds after i'm done with that i just add like and subscribe where i want them to be then i go ahead to make thumbnails export thumbnails export the video upload schedule so sometimes my video has been scheduled like two weeks ahead i said maybe i need to put out the video immediately then that's it what exactly do you do on youtube are you new here i'm a lifestyle content creator all things lifestyle so i don't have a niche where do you shop your clothes from mostly sheen or forever 21 or custom made will you ever work in the health industry maybe what advice will you give to someone that feels lost and trying to find themselves i would say keep trying and i've done so many things just to find myself so just keep doing it and when you see one particular thing that's very consistent for you then stick to it and also pray to god about it because i feel like i have been living my life on like very unintentional in a very unintentional way like there's no plan all of that and when i start involving god in things of my life and start speaking to him about what i want open your mouth and ask and just know that maybe it might be slow but it's definitely going to come so yeah that's one thing i did in the beginning of this year i was so intentional about how i wanted this year to go and i spoke to god about it and yeah he said working on it one thing is that i also had a mental breakdown last night but that's okay sometimes it happens and i had a good cry but that that should not make you feel bad that god isn't working to sort all your problems why did you stop jam comida i just stop i still cook for people but like once in a while so it's not something that i do every time but i still do but i'm looking forward to coming back soon anyways maybe when i come back you recognize me I need to go now. If you're new on my channel, please like, subscribe, share, all that good stuff. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye, guys. Until then, see Zesto. Zesto, sponsor your girl. Bye.